Mr. Simpson, I do vote to grant parole when eligible. And that will conclude this hearing. Thank you. OJ fought back tears as the Nevada Parole Board voted unanimously to grant him his freedom. He'll be released on October 1st. That's 73 days from today. Simpson, who is 70 years old, wore jeans and a blue button down, and he was in considerably better shape than his last parole hearing in 2013. I've come here, I've spent nine years making no excuses about anything. I am sorry that things turned out the way they, they did. And I would never, ever pull a weapon on anybody. Simpson, who was acquitted of double murder in 1995, was convicted in an armed robbery case involving sports memorabilia in Nevada in 2008. This morning, OJ's mood went from calm to contentious when he was asked about it. So you believe that the property was yours? It's been ruled legally by the state of California that it was my property and they've given it to me. I don't think you should want to upset the parole guy. E.T. watched the parole hearing this morning with Cato Kalin, O.J.'s former house guest, who testified in the criminal trial. Knowing from what I've heard before, I thought he was going to be paroled. So it's not, uh, it's not a, a shock to me or a surprise to me at all. It's strange to hear his voice. It really is. It's that this distinctive O.J. voice. It's, yeah, sort of chilling. Simpson will serve the minimum nine years of a 33-year sentence. I've done my time. I've i just like to get back to my family and friends, and believe it or not, I do have some real friends. As for what's next for OJ, well, Cato hopes he will stay away from the spotlight. Let's face it, I, th I think my opinion is he got the biggest break of his life because I thought he was guilty in, the, uh, in his murder trial. And uh, I, th I think he, getting out of this, I think he has to go down to Florida and probably just be with his family, be with his kids and never be seen from again. Although I don't think that's what's gonna happen.